different formats in which they communicate uh, the result, uh, whether it's accepted or rejected. Some have a detailed checklist format, mm -hmm. and some journals they uh, just have a paragraph explaining. Uh, so, in in your case, how do you communicate information about rejection, and do you give any kind of resources to uh, to authors? Uh, well, we actually do have you know, a checklist um, for our reviewers. We have, and as I mentioned before, we um, have our uh, GIE um, reviewer guide, basically, that our reviewers can work through when they become reviewers. So they know what they're looking for, and they know what kind of comments the authors are expecting in return. Um, so I, we, we really encourage them to... Um, to go through the manuscripts uh, thoroughly, um, point out any constructive criticism that they have. Um, really, their their goal is to help the authors improve their paper. So, if it does happen to be rejected, it's not going to be this was rejected because this, this, and this. It's um, these are some concerns we had and ways in which you might improve it.